Britain at the dawn of the 17th century. A nation united under a single ruler, but divided by three versions of a single book. God is my shepherd, therefore I can lack nothing. The Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. Dominus reget me, et nihil mihi de erit. This is the story of a king who knew the power of the Bible to unify his people. It's the story of the greatest minds of an era, setting their differences aside to express the word of God to the people. Truly, good Christian reader, we never thought from the beginning that we should need to make a new translation, nor yet to make of a bad one a good one, but to make a good one better, or out of many good ones, one principal good one. It's about the struggle between painstaking accuracy Love envieth not, love doth not frowardly and eloquent expression. Charity envieth not, dealeth not perversely, is not puffed up. It's a story of conflict, attempted assassination, and civil war. Remember, remember, the 5th of November, the gunpowder, treason, and plot. A story of diligent effort and of mistakes. Thou shalt commit adultery. Thou shalt commit adultery. And ultimately, it's a story about finding the truth that was right in front of them all along. KJV, the making of the King James Bible. The story behind the most popular work in the history of the English language. And God saw everything he had made, and behold, it was very good.